said, I feel like we've been dealing with these extreme heat warnings, and it's rare because we've never had them before. Yeah, and now we're having know, a bunch of them. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the sixth one so far, and of course they've all occurred this year because that's when the National Weather Service changed the criteria and lowered the threshold for us to have these ex excessive heat warnings, which really is to give you all a heads up. This is the reason why we're issuing a next weather alert as we want you to be prepared for this extreme and dangerous heat and that excessive heat warning is in effect for all of South Florida, even including the keys today until 7 p.m. Highs will soar to the mid to upper 90s. It'll feel like 110 to 115 degrees. Yesterday we had a record heat index of 113 degrees. That's what it felt like in Miami at the airport. Saharan dust is trying to bring a bit drier air, although there will be some storms later on. Although the rain chance will remain relatively low for this time of year through the work week, changes ahead for your upcoming weekend. And as you're already starting to make those plans, I will let you know why we're going to see more in the way of storms, but that'll also bring us some relief from this heat.